So obviously I fly a lot with this job and uh, people ask me if I am afraid to fly these days, I'm not. But I'll tell you what I hate, I hate these really small planes they put you on whenever you have to make a connection that isn't near a major airport. I did this one gig, connected me like four times, man. The planes just kept getting smaller and smaller. Last one didn't have a pilot, just some guy on the ground holding remote control. <laughs> and how is it you can learn to fly a jumbo jet but cannot learn to make an announcement over the PA without getting stumped? <laughs> Every pilot in the world does the same thing. Uh, ladies and gentlemen, this is your captain. Uh, we've landed. And I want to know whose great idea it was to always pass out the peanuts two and a half hours before beverage service. <laughs> After everybody's completely dehydrated. <laughs> Would you like something to drink? Nah, just keep bring me more peanuts, will ya? I'd like to resemble Lot's wife by the time we land. <laughs> they finally get you, well, they bring you a cup about that big. Oh, thanks, we haven't communion? Did I get a wafer with this? <laughs> So now I'm drinking shots of Pepsi. <laughs> Ding! Set him up again, darling. Rounds for everybody. <laughs> they hate when you ring that thing. Sometimes they don't even show up, right? You're like, Ding! <laughs> Ding, -ding, 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 -ding. <laughs> they finally get there. What? Where were you? In the basement? Yes, Stuart, it's gonna get a pillow, please. Not a big pillow, one about the size of a chick little do. Thank you very much. First time I saw those, I thought they were earplugs. Sticking one in each ear.